Hey, what's going on, YouTube? The Wi-Fi is currently frying my testicles right now. Anyway, this is Domination on Combine. I'm playing with my uh, buddy from San Antonio, Alpha Burger King. And um, I'm using the VMP. Got a nice little camo on there I made. Uh, anyway, this is the VMP with Quick Draw, Grip, Rapid Fire, and Fast Mags. This, uh, this fucking level is constantly in the rotation. Um, they haven't fixed that yet, I guess. Uh, hopefully they fix that with the next patch and the DLC and all that stuff. I like the map. I don't mind at all. When I play it, I usually go, uh, you know, from the spawn that I was on. Um, I usually go around left side, try to juke them, flank them, whatever the hell I can. But anytime I, uh... I get a kill or something with this, uh, with any gun. Try to, you know, pick up their gun as well so I have another backup. Just in case I, uh, run out of ammo or whatever if I'm not using extended mags. Or scavenger. So I like to rotate from B flag to A flag. And I like to watch both of them. You know, I'll camp a little bit. I'll do whatever the fuck it takes for a kill. You know, like I said, the Wi-Fi is, um frying my testicles right now but that's besides the point <clears throat> so I start off kind of shitty right now at the beginning I think this commentary is 61 and 8 61 kills 8 deaths and um, I didn't even feel like I was trying at all you know like I said the uh, the control freaks I have on my PS4 controller they helped me out a lot surprised I haven't broken yet also, the BenQ monitor that I also use has a 2 millisecond response time, which is a big difference from using just the LCD TV or plasma or whatever the hell you want to use. I totally recommend using monitors over a TV. So I try to capture as many flags as I can. It's free points, you know, it's like a scenic view, you know, you stand on the flag, you look at everything, oh look! I just forgot I was in the battle zone, and as soon as you capture that flag, you're back in the war again, okay? I usually use stock on this gun. I don't think I have it on there. Uh, stock helps you move a lot faster uh, while while zooming in, whatever ADS and whatever you want to call it. Um, I'm using combat focus as well. Combat focus will help you to get higher kill streaks that you wouldn't you wouldn't normally get um, it does help a lot it lasts a while you know say you're off a couple of points or whatever hit that combat focus capture a flag bada bing right whatever um, so once I once I get kind of next to their spawn I'll basically just kind of you know jog around an area until you know they start capturing like they're doing now capturing C I'm playing with other, one other guy, like I said, and um, that's all you usually need is one other person. I usually play um, solo, and every time I play solo, I usually do pretty good, but it's, it's better to have at least one other person with you. So, as you can see, I have all my kill streaks. Uh, I'm not going to send any of them off. I'm going to save it for the next round. If I send them off now, I don't... I think they would expire before the time, before the time limit of, uh, before the second round begins. So I'm going to save those, and, um, I'm just trying to catch people off guard in any, any fucking way I can, and just shred them, make them bleed, make their brains blow up, put holes in their belly, whatever the hell you want to say. Just capture as many flags as you can for domination, that's just how you got to do it easy 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 score streaks Woo! but um yeah it's kind of a long match it um it, you know usually my matches that I have on domination are longer matches that's why I like playing them I don't play TDM because I feel like you're not getting uh, the credit aka score streaks that you that you should be getting for the amount of work you're doing I just feel like it's like a waste of my energy to play Team Deathmatch because I'm not getting those high kill streaks and that's not fun to me. 
But um, basically the whole team is fucking negative already, and that's just the first round. And like I said, me and my friend, we're not even trying right now. We're just kind of warming up. But yeah, let's move on to uh, the second half. Halftime, right? No halftime show, nothing. No robot booty dancer cheerleaders, nothing. Damn, that would be nice though, right? No, that would be nasty, right? Fucking robot booty dancer. Okay, so we're on to the second half here. Can't use my kill streaks. I understand that. They don't want me fucking them up right away. Blowing their brains out with my fucking wraith and shit. You know what I'm saying, man? Chicken booty dancing? Damn, man. <laughs> anyway. Okay, calm down, Dustin. Anyway. So... Obviously, uh, B is the most important flag, and, you know, I fucking always ask my teammates, come on, come on, help me get B, come on, come on, B, 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 whatever. I don't have to ask my friend Airberg to do it, he knows what the fuck to do. Look, he's already there. Oh, Airberg, look it, it's you, bro! But, um, sorry, I'm getting all excited here. So, you know, I have a couple deaths here and there, the fucking wraps are off. The spiky balls. Spiky balls of doom, you know what I'm saying? Spiky balls of doom shred people. I think there's two... Uh, two drops of spiky balls when you call in the race. <clears throat> Unless they shoot them down or something like that. I, I'm probably wrong. I call in the wraith usually over B or over their spawn. If you call it over their spawn, you have to uh, make sure that the side that you spawned on doesn't get overrun or else you're wasting your raid. So B is probably the better of the two. <clears throat> like I said, this this VMP is just it's just one of the best guns. A lot of people you know, there's YouTube videos where they're saying it's uh it's it's not as good as people think or it's the god gun. I I think it's just an all around good gun. I don't think it's overpowered or anything. Lightning strikes are the best for domination. For a low kill streak, lightning strike is the best because you have three different strikes you call in for one lightning strike. You can hit all three flags if you need, you can hit two flags if you need, or you can just hit all their spawn up and just decimate them to where they don't know what to do and that that lowers their uh, the team morale so that they just they get pissed off, stressed out, whatever. It gets them out of their groove and then you start doing better. Now I don't know who the, who the, who the uh, host was of this match, I just assume we were because we were shredding him. <clears throat> but, you know, I'll take whatever kills I can get in this. Uh, so anyway, we're at, you know, about 75% of the uh, domination now. Looks like I got more spike balls. The Wraith just shreds with the wraps. The combination of lightning strike... Wraith and Raps is one of the best combos I've come across. Um, I think the Hater would be a better choice if I wanted to go for a nuclear, but I haven't really tried to go for those yet because I always the kill streaks always steal all my kills. So instead of getting gun kills and stuff like that, I guess you know the Raps and the Wraith are uh, taking more kills, which is kind of cheap, I guess. But I'm working on that. I'm, as we speak, I'm, uh, I'm actually working on trying to get a nuclear. I came pretty close the other day. I'm not gonna upload one of those until I get a nuclear. So, fucking 30 gun kill streak. That's tough to do in this game, for me at least. <clears throat> but anyway, this game's about wrapping up, and uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the commentary. This was the first take. I really don't care how stupid I sound or whatever. That's how I am. I like fucking being as retarded as possible. No offense to any handicapped people. I think they're the nicest people in the world. They're not assholes like us normal people. But who's to say we're normal, right? Because I know I'm not. Chicken booty dancing? Damn, man. You know what I'm saying? Anyway. So I hope you guys enjoyed this commentary. Uh, leave a like or a thousand dislikes if you want. Uh... And uh, basically, I hope you guys come back for more, because there'll be uh, more of this coming. Oh yeah, and uh, an update, I will be getting a PC pretty soon. 
Uh, I met this gentleman at my job. He was a very, very nice man. He uh, said he gave me a tip one day. I didn't even deserve it. And uh, he's going to help me pick out the parts, build a, you know, I don't know if he's going to help me build it or whatever, but he's going to at least help me pick out all the badass parts, give me the best bang for my buck for the computer. And that is awesome. And I always want to say thank you, sir. I really appreciate that. There actually are nice people out in the world. And, um, yeah, I hope you enjoy this commentary. I will see you guys later. Chicken booty dancing, man. Peace.